Hey YouTube and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I've got a build so good you'll have survivors screaming wall hacks. Make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on all notifications so you never miss a video. So what exactly is the Sadako wall hack build you might be asking? Well, it's a killer build that allows us to have an almost wall hack like ability, allowing us to see survivors auras through walls and other obstacles. Let's go over the perks that make this build Shan. So perks we'll be running today will be Lethal Pursuer. At the start of the trial, the auras of all survivors are revealed to us for 9 seconds. Second perk, nowhere to hide. Whenever we damage a generator, we reveal the aura of all survivors standing within 24 meters of our position. Third perk, Skirchuk Floods of Rage. Whenever a survivor is unhooked from a Skirchuk, all other survivors have their auras revealed for 7 seconds. And lastly, but not least, a fan favorite, Barbecue and Chili. After hooking a survivor, all other survivors' auras are revealed to us for 4 seconds when they are further than 40 meters from the hook. So as you can see, with all these perks combined, you will literally be accused of wall hacks. Who dares disturb me from my slumber? Okay, ladies and gentlemen, welcome. Welcome to the Sadako wall hack build. So as we can see here, we have the survivors here on the radar, thanks to Lethal Pursuer. We'll uh, go after the uh, tea baggers here, having a bit of a fun, have a bit of a jokey jokey around. Uh, but you don't joke around with Sadako because when we de-manifest... Surprise! Oh, force punch right in your head. There you go, Yunjin. Uh, let's get in hot pursuit of Yunjin. We'll obviously utilize our power. Just in case we need to teleport to one of the generators. Alright, so we've got barbecue chili, floods of rage here and Skirchuk. Which would be good aura reading perks. I Okay, I'll take the down. Scare up. Speaking of Floods of Rage, let us get to a Scourge Hook. And what do you know? Here is one we prepared earlier. So we'll get him on here. Boom. Lovely. Okay, so we've got two here. Obviously, Barbecue Chili worked out. Oh, the gens popped. All right, we uh, see if we can get in pursuit here. Slow him down a little bit. These cheeky buggers, they got one gen done. Now we all know that Sushi does not like it when you complete gens. How dare you, lovely backpack. There you go. Okay, so Floods of Rage have activated. As we can see, we can see the auras. So the great thing behind this build is that we've got eyes everywhere, which is fantastic. Granted, we don't really have much gen defense, but it is pretty... We don't really need it as much when we're going to be um, knowing where all the survivors are at all times, which is fantastic. Alright, so let us get the hook here. Hopefully we can damage a generator and um, obviously show how nowhere to hide works. Alright, so we've got a survivor there. There's barbecue chili working out. And we'll surprise. Hello, Yun. Big fan, big fan. Alright, that's a gen done. Okay. Alright, we're at three gens. That's okay. Not everything's lost. Not everything's lost. We'll just stay in pursuit with Yunjin. We'll try to get this hook. The good thing with Barbecue Chili and Floods of Rage is it's basically, they complement each other quite well. Obviously, one, we hook within range, we get the auras. When they unhook within range, we get auras. Where did she go? There she is. So that is uh, one of the awesome things about this perk. Uh, see if we can get her over here. Yeah, we'll make it easy peasy lemon squeezy. And here you go. Boom. All right, so Floods of Rage activated again. All right, so the inside building will teleport. Here we go. Perfect. That worked out quite well. We'll get the tab on you. You should have healed. You should have healed. Next hook. Where are we? Here we are. Okay, there we go. So we know they're down there, obviously, because uh, we can see the auras there mending. They're mending on the hook, I believe. All right. Let's teleport back down there and say hello. All right, they seem to have disappeared. It's okay, we're in pursuit. No, I see some scratch marks. Here we are. All good. Have we got any TVs? Oh, I hear someone. Where are we? Where are we? All right, we're going into the main building. All right. Teleport out. 
here we go that worked out well there we go all right we'll go after mr david see if we can get the hit hope there's no pallets here oh, worth a shot worth going for the hit right, let's use our power again let's go back to the furthest gen down here oh, no nothing's going on down here it's bogus absolutely bogus all right let's uh see where we can go to next see if we can get a hit maybe we can get a run and hit that's what we want to try and do run and hit hit and run or hit and run as i like to say all right we've got a gen here see if we can sneak up can't see me i'm like john cena in dead by daylight all right let's use nowhere to oh, before we use nowhere to hide we'll get the hit so let's use nowhere to hide bang so as you can see aura is beautiful we would have known he was there otherwise so there we got that hit on him nice lovely 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 one of the benefits to know where to hide okay manifest out she didn't see me i was back in my john cena way they should do an emote for sadako where she can actually just wave her hand like john you can't see me da -da -da. oh shit oh, that's all right kind of scared me all right she's gone i believe she's on death hook right now and let me manifest out there you go all right, let's pick her up. Boom. All right, we got any scourge hooks around? Mm. All right. Because I believe she's on third hook, we should be able to get on with this hook. Yep, all right, she's out. Okay. Three left, three gens. Not bad. Keeping the pressure up. All right. Let's get this gen again. So we're going to activate nowhere to hide. There we go. All right, going into shack, which is lovely. Let us uh, manifest. De-manifest, sorry. See if we can get the surprise attack here. Crawl in. No, it didn't work. Oh, it did work. There we go. We're in pursuit. Roger that. We're in pursuit. Right, see if we can get the hit on Jake here. There you go, Jakey, Jakey. Oh, they activated that gen again. Let's get that aura reading. All right, so Felix is in the building. Uh, good old Jake's over here. We'll, uh, we'll commit to Jake. We're still at three gen, so... We've got a bit of time, so we'll uh, we'll commit to this chase. Let's see if we can uh, play the uh, mind games here. He's gone. He played mind games on me, and he's booked it. He's in another state, another suburb. Uh, let's see if we can trap him. No, that bamboozled on me quickly. <laughs> uh, well, did it? I meant that. There we go. Jen, nowhere to hide. Let's find where we all uh, survivors are. Uh, where are we? Alright, we'll just go after the um, Felix here. Alright, Jen's been completed. We're at two now. Not a problem. We'll go to this Jen. We might as well. Because it got completed. So who was here? Oh, we've got scratch marks. Let's follow. No. Yes. Oh, I hear someone. There we go. It's Jake. Lovely. Lovely. Bang. There we go. And we got ourselves a scourge hook right there too. So let's take him there. Well, let's get that... Uh, Floods of rage value. Here we go. Lovely. All right, now barbecue chili, talk to me, darling. All right, there we go. We are popping out of a TV. Surprise, you're on candy camera, motherfucker. Hello. Put a shirt on, it's cold out here. All right, let us go back to the gen. More information, more information. All right, where are we? Where are we looking at? Let's go to this one. They might go to save. Yep, beautiful. Lovely. Alright, your turn, Felix. Pull one weed and another takes its place. What the hell happened there? Let's put you up here. There we go, two down there. Ah, oh, they turned my TV off. Son of a bitch. That's uh, alright. We can sneak up on them again. Remember, they can't see us. Well, now they can, but... Oh, Jen done. Alright, we're just going to go for Chase for Jake. Let's get him out of the way. All right, we've got a scourge hook here. Beautiful. Let's put you up here. And the next one. Uh, TV's not back on. All right, we'll go to that TV there, see if we can switch around. Hopefully. There we go. We'll go for the thing. Try to get a hit on it. Oh, we got stuck in the tree. Where are the pruners when you need them? They do their damn job. There we go. 
Also, another pro tip, guys, which I'm pretty sure you probably know, but I learned this from Oddstarver. Whenever you um, want to fake um, a pallet uh, smash, just use your power in admittedly. And it's kind of like a, a, a fake. So the survivors might even try to do the dumb tech when I might vault back over. So. Alright, let us go through here. There we go. We can see. No, we can't. Oh, here we are. We'll go detectable. Right, we'll get you down. Damn, it didn't work. Alright, we'll get the J-key. Ah, short people problems. Alright, let us transfer over here. See if we can catch him out. Damn, we couldn't. That's alright. Oh, maybe. Alright, let us crawl our ass out of here. Eh. Alright, we're out. Oh, yeah, go, Jakey boy. Alright, let us use. There we go. So we've got Jakey there. Uh, where did the Felix go? Alright, let's just go to the TV. There we go. Jake, how you going, buddy? Alrighty. Pick him up. All right, so hopefully barbecue chili will work. Oh, there he is. He's condemned. Lovely. Yeah. See if we can get him in this condemned state. Mm, maybe, maybe not. We'll try. So where have you gone? Felix. You can't hide from me forever. And that condemned state's over. That's fine. Oh, here we go. Hugging pallets. I see him, my good man. Let's try a bit of mind games. Is he going left? Is he going right? Where's he going? And we're coming in for the home run. There we go. Let's pick you up, good sir. Lovely outfit. Lovely cosmetics, by the way. Uh, let us put you on this hook here. There you go. All right, guys. There you have it. The wall hack build. Definitely give it a shot. Let me know in the description below if... In the comments below, sorry, if you uh, would put any spin on this. I'd love to hear your ideas. But yeah, guys, take care. I hope you enjoyed the video, and I'll see you in the next one.